Welcome to this breaking episode of SpaceX in the News. I'm Kevin, and just hours ago, SpaceX's Mars rocket prototype knocked itself out of the race when it prematurely blew its load. So earlier this week, the Mark 1 prototype underwent its first leak check to test the fuel tanks in preparation for a 20 kilometer flight that was supposed to take place by the end of the year. And from what everybody could tell, it must have went well. Most likely the tanks were filled with nitrogen or helium gas during pressurization, and at which time the controlled venting could be seen coming out of the vessel. And it was even noted that the rocket's dimps were smoothed out because of the pressure. That too was expected. Then following the test, SouthPadre.com noticed crews spraying down the body with an unknown substance for an unknown reason. But everything must have gone according to plan. Because today, SpaceX filled the top tank with liquid-cooled oxygen for another pressure test. But this time, the top bulkhead blew completely off the rocket and, of course, outspilled enough oxygen to make everyone in Boca Chica high on life. You can check out the entire situation over on Lab Padre's YouTube channel. Elon then quickly addressed the situation by tweeting that SpaceX will move on to the Mark III prototype down there in Boca Chica, where they will implement the necessary changes to fix the problem, and he also said that Mark III will have a different flight design. Well, that does it for this breaking news episode. Make sure you check back this weekend for episode 66. Many of you requested that I post my speech that I gave this weekend on the new space race. I did that today. You can find it at the end of this video. Take care and Godspeed.